once while on stage, Leno and I persisted with the show despite suspecting there was a dead audience member in the front row. <gasps> Ooh. Was the show going well? <laughs> it was a good show, but um, what happened was this person had gone like this, down like that, <laughs> just leant forward, right? And I thought, fantastic, they're laughing so much <laughs> that they're going to go... I looked over and they're going to go... <laughs> <laughs> Yes. <laughs> like that. And I looked at them and they didn't come up. <laughs> and I was just like... And I just went on with the, with the show for a bit. And then when I checked in the next time, they were still down. <laughs> and I thought, I think they might have just died. <laughs> at some point, did you say to Colin, like, did you, did you just keep doing the show? Or did you at one point have to go, I'm going to check on this person? Or After about ten minutes, the, you know, my, uh, um, my empathy got the better of me. And I said, uh, excuse me, this person seems to have collapsed. Are you OK? And they went... Oh, I'm looking for my jumper. <laughs> <laughs> for ten minutes? Yeah. For ten minutes? Yeah. That's a long time to look for a jumper. Isn't it? How can, how can you check such a small spot yes, for ten minutes? exactly. Beg your pun? Well, if, if they bend down, they've got the... They can check the this space of their arms can reach, how would that take ten minutes? <laughs> what had happened was they'd, um, they'd put their jumper on the floor and somebody had been walking in later and had gotten caught up in the jumper <laughs> and had kicked it and it had gone more than a seat's worth under. So they were basically... We couldn't see, but they were under there, they are like, <laughs> going... <laughs> like, trying to reach behind the seat to get the... See, the thing you guys don't know is that Lano and Woodley a slapstick, and so is all of their audience. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's, you know, that, oh, that reminds me of the time I saw a goat being born. But, um, <laughs> but that's another story. Why did the goat have hands? <laughs> what the hell? It was an artistic interpretation <laughs> of hoofs. How did the audience respond when you said, I'm sorry, I think this person's not OK, and they sat up and said, oh, I was just looking for my jumper. I think Colin said the thing of going, oh, when I saw you with, the, with your head down, I was hoping you were going to come up going... <laughs> and the audience all laughed at that, and then we just moved on. Is this towards the end of the show, or was it, like, intermission? What's the, you know...? Yeah, it was intermission. Everybody had gone. <laughs> and, which made it not quite as... Colin, everyone's <laughs> left apart from him. I'm pretty sure he's dead. <laughs> can, can I just say something? I don't want to stab you in the back as one of my idols, and, I'm, and we're on the same team, but I'm about to. Um, so, my boyfriend once did a show. He, he's a comedian, too. Big fans. Anyway, so he did a show, and a guy in the front row was slumped over... And unlike you, my boyfriend stopped the show pretty quick. The show went in the toilet, ambulances came, yeah, he yeah. was passed out, and then he got aggressive, and it was a whole thing. It was a big gossip. Yeah. So I am either disappointed or it's bullshit that you watch someone slumped over for ten minutes without saying anything when I know you to be a beautiful man. Well, I actually... <laughs> I appreciate, I appreciate your um, commendations there, but I actually went to your boyfriend's show that <laughs> night and I remember the guy being taken into the ambulance going, I was just looking for my jumper! <laughs> <laughs> All right, Charlie's team, we're going to need an answer. Is that true or a lie? He's a really good storyteller. You're I... so good. Just, you don't look for ten minutes in the one little spot. This guy's... <laughs> it doesn't make any sense. Seems like a big old lie to me. <laughs> Did I say jumper? Hearing aid. He was looking for his hearing aid and he couldn't enjoy the show unless he found it. Can we just cut in hearing aid every time I said the word jumper? <laughs> look like this. You look down the barrel and say jumper and then this is what it'll sound like, OK? So now okay. The hearing aid. I'm happy with that. <laughs> no one will ever know. He's, I think he's got such an honest face. I think he's telling the truth. I... I am going to say true. <gasps> I think it's oh, true. Oh, see, they think it's bullshit. <laughs> if it's true, then Lano and Woodley are horrible, horrible people who don't check on <laughs> dead audience members. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> All right. They're saying that it's true. Frank, 
Well, Is I'm just true? glad that I'm playing against you guys and not against the audience, because it's a lie. Oh! It is, of course, a lie, although I've been in the audience for some shows where I wish that I was dead. <laughs>